Hi beautiful people, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we have another recipe video. We'll be making some English scones uh, that you can have for breakfast with some tea or coffee or any time of the day with some soup, right? Um, welcome. So I started out with making some buttermilk. You can buy some from the store. If you don't have an alternative of getting some from the store, you can make some with um, enough milk that we will use. We used one cup of milk and some vinegar, about a teaspoon of vinegar. Just stir that in and put it aside. Then take your bowl, add two and a half cups of self-raising flour. Then add one and a half tablespoon of sugar. You can adjust uh, the level of sugar depending on how sweet you want your, your scones to be. Then I added in a quarter cup of coconut flakes for some flavor. And then one teaspoon or just a pinch of salt. Then add a cup of butter, cold butter, this should be cold. Uh, immediately you get it from the fridge use that then I added some chocolate chips this is totally optional you can leave it that way but you know we're not basic over here <laughs> then you will want to incorporate everything in there with clean hands emphasis on clean hands until it looks somewhat like breadcrumbs I'll show you And this is kind of the texture I'm talking about. This is the texture we're looking for. The butter and everything else should be incorporated. There should be no um, solid butter in there. Just incorporate everything with the flour. Then create kind of like a well inside there and pour in your buttermilk. So after adding your milk, bring that flour on the side where the milk is and then after you do that, knead gently, don't use any machines or anything like that, you can alternately be, use a wooden split but you should knead gently, really really gently. Transfer your dough into a clean surface and dust the surface and work on your dough there, gently work on your dough there. Now I wanted to build layers but you can pretty much skip this, um, this, uh, this step but I folded to make the, the layer, I just fold two times and then I cut in the middle and then I, uh, I put them together again.
after three times, I think you're done with the earring. And then now we make a tattoo should be about an inch tall and not less and not more than that because if it's more, the scones will fall on your baking. At this point, make your egg wash. I used one egg and about a teaspoon of water. You can use milk if you have. If you want to use milk, you just whisk that in. Take a brush and just apply the mixture on top of the of your of your of your scones. This should make. This is used to make your scones golden brown on top. Used to make that brown finish on top. They should look like so and then at this point you put them in your preheated oven of about 180 degrees celsius for 10 minutes or 12 minutes 10 to 12 minutes should be okay the remainder of the egg wash i use to make an egg because i don't waste anything in the house after 10 minutes my scones are done thank you so much for watching please subscribe and share and i hope you enjoy this with a loved one and if you don't enjoy it with a laptop, I hope you enjoy it by yourself because you deserve it. Thank you.